be able to come back to your kind of your mindset at that point? Uh, I was glad it was halftime. Had a little time to uh, you know get ourselves, get our plan back together, uh, get loose. Um, you know, it's always unfortunate, but uh, you know, the cold went away real quick, and uh, you know some excitement came around, and I was ready to go. How did you feel out there? Felt good. Uh, yeah, I think the toughest part was just yeah, I expected to come online a little bit quicker than what I what I did. Those first two drives, I, I missed a couple of critical throws. Um, really, just a matter of getting my feet settled and, uh, and, and feeling comfortable. You know, I, I'd hoped it'd, take a, it'd be a little bit quicker than it was. It has been a while since you were in a game where, other than the conversions, where you know it really mattered, or wasn't a fourth quarter or third, fourth quarter game. Did it, did it feel strange to you at all? Or? <laughs> uh, it felt better, honestly. I mean, you know, it's nice to be playing for something, yeah, per se. I mean, not that. Not that it doesn't always matter. You know, there isn't. Uh, you know, there's always putting it on film, but uh, this was more than that. This was a chance to, to get in with, with these guys and uh, you know, really make a difference. And, and you know, always a comeback's always a good story. It's always fun, but uh, yeah, it just didn't swing our way. Did you feel there was a greater sense of urgency for you to get going because you're down so much? And you know, I honestly wouldn't say any more than had it been tied or had had we been up. Uh, you know. A couple of scores, uh, and there's always the, the you always have to keep moving. You always have to, to put points on the board. Uh, you know, anytime you stall like that, you put yourself in trouble. So, you know, I, I think with coming in how we were, you know, obviously there, there is a little more urgency to it. But uh, and we had plenty of time. We had two quarters left, and uh, you know, it wasn't like we'd have to run two minute. You know, it wasn't coming in the fourth quarter down 30. So, um, yeah, played a little bit, but I don't think it was a huge factor. Did it seem like a payout was kind of in the backfield all day long? Or yeah. Kind of um, trying to get away from him? Yeah, they, they did a good job. And, uh, you know, we, we just, you know, we had our chances. We had, we, you know, like I said, I had missed throws and, and, and stuff that I went back. And so, uh, you know, they did a good job on their part. But uh, I still think we, we, we could execute our game and uh, played a lot better. How does this change for you now going forward, knowing you know, the, the two games coming up and where you might be well, right now. You know, I, at this point, uh, after this game, you know, I'm hoping I get another shot at it. Um, you know, it's, it's, uh, we'll see what happens. But uh, I'm prepared and, uh, you know, get to go in. Hopefully you go in the first quarter and then play a whole game. And, uh, you know, I feel good. I feel like this game was, was good for me. To, to, you know, I feel like toward the end there, I felt fine. You know, I felt my arm was fine. My feet were fine. I was seeing things. Um, We'll see what happens with Matt, but uh, I'm ready to go this week uh, with whatever happens. How would you describe the, the, the atmosphere in the locker room after this game? Were guys shocked? What yeah, I'd, yeah, I'd say shocked. I mean, guys weren't, you know, I, I don't really know how you say it. I mean, it, you know, it hurts that uh, some, certainly nobody plans for. I don't mean, ever expect anything like that, but, uh, uh, you know, I don't. I think losing is one thing. I think losing the way we did, um, and feeling like we, you know, we there were times when we really had some control that uh, we we kind of gave up. That's how I feel about it. So that's the hardest part for me, and that's what hurts the most is that uh, you know, we had our chances at it, and uh, you know at least on my part, you know, I didn't execute when on times when I think really would have helped us. In fall camp, uh, Lane said that you and Matt had the same ga game plan. That was the beauty of you as a backup. Is that still true at this point of the season? That was true tonight. We didn't change anything. We we, we ran our stuff. We did uh, we did our offense. And uh, like I said, aside from the, the you know the fact that I feel like I missed some critical stuff that uh, just had to get settled on. Uh, you know, I I know the stuff. I know how to execute it. And I think we're we're perfectly capable of executing. Um, and uh, you know, just wish I would have showed that a little bit more. But uh, yeah, I feel like we're fine. Did you feel like the team was mentally prepared for this week? Yeah, I, you know, I, I'm only give to answer most of those questions. Uh, I'm not going to answer it for the whole team, but uh, uh, you know, like I said, I feel like we had our shots, we had our chances, so uh, I let him take the larger picture on that one. Anything else for Mitch? Matt, tell you anything at halftime, or was he just, you know, with his injury? No, we didn't see him at halftime. Uh, I imagine they were looking at him. Uh, I talked to him for a few seconds while we were out there in the third quarter somewhere. So, 
you know, I don't know what his status is, how he's feeling, what's up with that, but uh, we'll see. Thank you.